hours after neighbors gathered storm debris in neat piles on the side of the road. Giant trucks from Jackson County were out first thing Monday morning. We got a job to do. We're going to get it done. However long it takes. However long it takes. Sunday it was about securing homes and getting a handle on the damage. Today the cleanup really begins. Homeowners who made it through this relatively unscathed were busy helping others who weren't so lucky. It, it took a lot of people, but it, everybody in the neighborhood pitched in and helped, you know. Oh, I'm going to relax today. I'm not doing nothing today. More work remains around the neighborhood. You can see tarps over roofs, windows secured. At this house, the storm peeled off the brick facade and warped the back porch. Across the street, a giant tree still blocks the driveway to this home. And a block away at Jerome Cole's house, his new roof needs some work. Mostly try to clean up a lot of loose debris and stuff and uh, calling someone to come to repair the... Uh, I just had a new roof put on. Oh, it looks oh, last no. uh, last week. Jackson County's EMA director says 16 homes were damaged by Sunday's EF1 tornado. Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.